Uh, Franklin County RVs rolling one nine, departing to the south, Franklin County. On this flight to the Washington Cifra, I make a bad decision on the return leg and pick up some ice. Good morning, we're only coming approach experimental 95 Victor Tango. Experimental 95 Victor Tango, brilliant to approach, maintain VFR, squawk 1433. 1433, maintain VFR. November 5, Victor Tango, radar contact, five miles south of the Franklin County Airport. I have a full route IFR clearance for you to pick up, uh, unless you want to maintain VFR on course to your destination. Yeah, go ahead. Five Victor Tango is clear to Charlie Golf Sierra via direct Delancey, spelled Delta November Yankee, direct Lake, spelled Lima, Alpha Alpha, Yankee Kilo, direct Lima, Romeo Papa, direct Echo Mike India, direct Wooly, spelled Whiskey, Oscar Oscar Lima Yankee, direct Maintain Niner Thousand. Okay, up to 9,000, uh, Delancey Lake, and then the uh, rest of the route as filed. 95 Victor Tango. 95 Victor Tango, Rebecca is correct, and just bear pay, maintain 9,000. 9,000, I'm climbing there now. Alright, so it looks like we might hit a cloud on our IFR clearance. It really was uh, pretty much what we put into the system. We're on our way down to Washington, D.C. I got, got to go down there for a week of work. Uh, so we're going to 433 contact button apply into the frizz. You give her Sam uh, 433. Be kind of curious if it's our most popular video. 35. 735. We'll see if this one is equally popular. Oh well, yeah, we touched the clouds. Good thing we were on IFR. The file for 9000 should be above it. The frizz, uh, you know, it's relatively easy to get in and out of that once you get your uh, special code. And so we did do that. Okay, so now we're up at 9,000, leveled off. I just thought I'd bring it on. You can see beautiful here with the mountains and the clouds. It's kind of beautiful. Uh, kind of lonely, no Jamie with me, so uh, i got to talk to somebody. You guys might find this interesting. He just cleared me from Lancaster, direct over to the Baltimore VOR, and then direct to destination uh, College Park. So just kind of interesting that we're uh, going right over Baltimore at 6,000 feet. It's kind of cool. Number six down at Cooper. Cool. Uh, College Park remain outside of Class Bravo airspace. Of course, College Park. There's our buddy Brian checking in, heading to College Park. Wait a minute. So here we are, right over downtown Baltimore. Uh, coming right up on it. Pretty darn cool. Get to fly right over downtown. 5,000 feet. is behind us, or we're in the Cifra, the Cifra right now. Get distracted. It's cool as heck, everything around here. All right, here we got Brian coming in on his approach. Oh, does not not look... Oh, yeah, he had to do the same thing I did, just not quite as much. Do you see that little slip he put in there? There's another little slip. <laughs> oh, he's making me feel better. There he goes. Nice stabilized approach. Beautiful. Nice landing, Brian. All right, I just missed it. I just uh, checked in with uh, Potomac and got my clearance out of here. It's going to be a VFR departure. Uh, we're going to climb up to 1,500 feet initially because that uh, keeps us under the CIFRA pick up our departure uh, and we're going to head out to basically it's a uh, vectors to 265 to Westminster then uh, a Victor 457 to the land to Lancaster and then route is filed so we'll get that put in the system here in just a second and we'll go from there make sure it looks about right looks about right Wind three five zero at four. Visibility one zero. Light drizzle three thousand five hundred scattered. 
ceiling, four, thousand, three, hundred, broken, five, thousand, overcast. Temperature, one, five, Celsius, two point, one, three, altimeter, two, niner, niner, one. Yeah. Again, kind of looking a little closer to our route. It doesn't look too as bad. First part is up there in Allentown area. But we're definitely, we can still look, see the ground, so. Not terrible. The owners are doing looks good. Got the heat on, a little bit of frost on. Outside air temperatures, 37 degrees. These are a little more uh, overcast at nine. Wow, might might stay underneath it the whole time. We will see. And then by the time we get up to Squint, Grant, Wilkesbury, could be VFR. It is VFR. Added at 26. Gotcha. Okay, so we're uh, basically west of Rutland right now. Rest of, you can see Lebanon, Rutland here. Uh, over New York State, Lake George uh, should be to our east here. Uh, Ticonderoga Airport is just to the east. You can see we've got a, it looks like probably an overcast layer. They're saying 3,000, uh, somewhere around there. So we're planning on the RNAV into Franklin County. I don't think we're going to have to do it. The, they're claiming the weather's clear up there, so this may be, we come to the end of it here somewhere a little bit further north, maybe just north of Burlington. Uh, we are currently about 50 miles south of the Burlington DOR. So, been a good flight, uh, pretty smooth once we got clear of uh, that weather that was kind of across the mid-Atlantic. And uh, it's been fun, so a little bit of uh, something we haven't done in a while. Cutting through uh, some moderate uh, weather, talking to AC, ATC to get some vectors around it. They were awesome about that. RB10. Uh, did a great job, took care of, a, of me, so very appreciative of that. Uh, we'll check in with you guys a little bit, let you know what the weather's going to be. Just to let you know, a couple things that I have been doing uh, is, if you look over here, I've already brought the approach plate is up, ready to go in case I need it there. I also went in and I put my field, brief, field chart here, so when I land, I can easily get the runway chart at the destination. And I uh, did the same thing here. I brought the approach plate here. I don't plan to run it here, but I use it here so I brief it, you know, like for instance, we're gonna do the, hopefully, Irimi, 3,000 feet or above, inbound course 006. Uh, decision height for this approach is 512 feet, and then a missed approach, we're gonna climb to 1,100 feet. And then a left-hand turn, continuing the climb up to 3,000 in Jutex. So, Kind of just to uh, kind of get my everything in a row prepared for the landing at Franklin County. All right, we just checked in with Burlington. Uh, he told us it's uh, layered between 45 and 65. Track three Tango Hotel radar. Contact. Cleared us uh, uh, to I for the straight in runway one. Say Franklin County. Nope, back to Syria. November 905 Victor Tango. Burlington arrivals are getting some light rime icing. Earlier reported between 6,000 and 4,500. If you start, uh, still pick it up at 5,000, just let me know and I can vector you, vector you around and get you in the lower MPA. Okay, I shall take that right now if you don't mind. Just uh, something I'll give you down to look for. Or November 9 or 5, Victor Tango, Roger. Fly heading of 030 and descend to maintain 4,000. 030, down to 495, Victor Tango, thanks. Reports of some light rime icing uh, by the arrivals into Burlington, so. They're getting out of it around below 5,000, so we're just going to take it nice and easy down to five, down to the top of the clouds here. And uh, once we hit that, we'll increase the rate of descent down to 500 feet per minute. Get us down below it at four, and uh, we'll deal with it there. Pedo heat is on, defrost is on. We're ready for our uh, as best we can for penetration. So here we are, we're gonna go we're going in the clouds here about six thousand. We got about two thousand feet, so we'll get clear of it. I don't think we'll pick up too much icing. We're just coming to worse. We got Burlington just to the right. We'll head over that way. Uh, we're trying to keep the motor a little bit uh I'm getting too cold here. Bring the speed back as well as we go downhill. No ice so far. Oh yeah, maybe a little bit now. 
Nothing too major, just a very little bit here. We've got about 1,500 feet to go to get clear. Keto heat is on. Outside air temperature is 20 degrees. A very little bit of ice here. Obviously getting on the windscreen now. It will be a no flap landing because of uh, all of this. Okay. Definitely the fair amount of ice out there now. Hey, you're starting to see out the bottom here. Uh, 4,500 feet. Still not quite out. November 9 or 5, Victor Tango, are you below the bases now? Altitude. Yeah, it looks like it's uh, 4,000 is going to work for us. I'd say it's about 4,300 feet right now, and we had the same a little bit of ice in it on the way through. Nothing major. November 9 or 5, Victor Tango, Roger. I'll have you over to Ramey here in just a minute, and if you need lower than 4,000, I could get a little bit lower for you. But right now, I'll just keep you at 4. Yeah, it looks like I'm going to go INC here in just a little bit. If you could give me a descent now, I got about 5 miles. November 9 or 5, Victor Tango, Roger, this is going to maintain 3,000. Down to 395, Victor Tango, thanks. Oh, God, there's a hole right above us. So we're going to land just a little bit fast. Build inside, 100 knots. Okay, power's coming back. Beginning our descent. Franklin County driving RV is on May 6 miles straight in, runway 1, full stop, Franklin County. Okay, mixture, prop, boost pump. Franklin County traffic RV is over the river now, just for planning purposes. I'm going to be at no flap, so expect me on the runway just a little longer, carrying a little bit of ice here. On this flight, I let ATC influence me, and I changed my plan, which was to descend where it was VFR with Franklin County. I learned from this event. Hopefully it was helpful for you as well. Fortunately, the state of Vermont has chosen to shut our airport for the summer, but we're using this as an opportunity to get 9 So we'll see you again when the airport opens.